looks as though Sivar Ramakrishnan will not bowl out his 10 overs. Kapil Dev and Sharma still six overs to bowl between them. It's in the air, there's a man up there, he's getting under it. Sharma's got it, has he? Yes, he has, well caught. Sharma not making the same mistake that Ravi Shastri did at cover, took a well-judged running catch, and the leg spinner strikes again. And that's been fairly typical of the standard of out cricket played by India in this championship. It wasn't a very good stroke. Salim Malik has been hitting his drives in the air. He wasn't to the pitch of that. He lofted it to the long off position and that was an exceptionally well judged catch by Chatan Sharma. Again, moving around the boundary and getting right underneath it. He never looked like dropping it. Six for one for you. Good hard hitting batsman. He replaces Salim Malik. He'll hold out it deep long off to a good running catch by Sharma now the league spinner comes into Javid as they crossed Creech is gone is he it's a good effort no he's got him what a good piece of bowling an excellent leg break got him forward and spun a mile Vizmanath had the bails off a brilliant piece of cricket and it looks as though India are going to bowl yet another side out with Shiva Ramakrishna now on the hat trick that was a superb leg spinner to defeat a man of the calibre of Javed Miandad who normally gets very close to the pitch of the ball is a mighty feat and the last hat trick indeed the only hat trick to be performed in one day internationals was by Jalalul Din of Pakistan against Australia at Hyderabad in 1982 so Miandad out for 48 7 for 1 3 1 the batsman it goes for the big hit there's a man down there he's getting under it it's arm enough he doesn't get back in time dear oh dear it crashes into the fence could have been a hat trick he was some 10 meters in from the fence he hit it straight what a courageous shot the crowd's gone mad at the moment to the ground <laughs> and that was an amazing piece of cricket with Sivaram Krishnan there feeding up the wrong one